Hello everybody, welcome back to more Enter the Gungeon. Beat the Gungeon 0% to 100%. We're doing a special thing today. It's uh, part one of a two-part collection of, of videos, I guess, where we're probably going to unlock... We're going to attempt to unlock the final three characters in one huge run that takes that takes two runs. So we'll see. Anyway, we start with the Deckard and the Clear Guan Stone. We're playing as the Paradox, if you're really not sh aware. This is the character we unlocked quite a while ago by stepping in the pool and beating the run. We get Deckard and... Uh, or we get random items. A random gun and a random passive slash active. Uh, we got Clear Guan Stone, which is okay. And Deckard, which is an amazing thing to start with. Uh, the downside of this character is that it does cost five credits. But we do need to play as this character to unlock the Gunslinger, which is one of the most OP characters. And we'll probably use it for... Uh, an unlock or so, just to, you know, not be worried about the old death. One thing I will say as a, just as a, as a thing, we're probably going to skip messing with the, um, messing with the shortcuts for today. I, I don't really want to have this be the run where we risk it. We do actually have to go for the Lich. We have to beat the Lich today as the Paradox. We do have, uh, one more pass to beat effectively again with uh the the pilot because as the pilot we got taken down to the the lich either the pilot or the marine in fact we might even have two wait a minute we might have two i don't remember we got at least one more past to redo but i just wanted to get this out of the way you know i i it's a it's a two-part process i needed to make sure i had enough time to do two runs in a row and today i got to Enough time to do two two runs in a row in separate episodes back to back here. So, how do you do? We are going to have a, a good time. Hopefully, we'll... Basically, the question mark here is, can I bring the robot to the end? We have two attempts at it. As far as I'm aware, we get two back to back shots at trying to do it. And then also, whether or not we get the fi final bullet kit. I believe there's only one more. I believe there's only one more. We'll see. We'll see. All right, we're gonna. I'm not gonna go to the uh, the darn sewers. We've been doing it, doing it a darn decent amount. Let's go for this. We got ourselves the icebreaker, which I think is, it's okay. It's okay. Freeze is a really good thing. But we also got the scope, which makes the flash ray like pretty darn solid. It takes the one thing that kind of sucks about it and uh, it deletes it. Accuracy is not much of an issue anymore. So we can use this really effectively for the first few floors here because it, you know, it's, we're not really going to want to use it later. The damage isn't super high on it or anything, but it's it's nice, uh, nice and piercing. And the ammo economy of it, really? The ammo economy of it is pretty darn slick. All right, but thank goodness we uh, don't have to worry about money or, or keys as much. We're just going to be doing a normal, legit run here because we need to be really we, or we want to be really strong really really strong okay uh or a gunny or a gunny's really good oh we had a synergy with it what's the synergy blade runner what is that what is that synergy it sort of looks like it's oh it does uh there's three shots in the deckard now okay Okay, that makes it significantly better. I always like quite like the Deckard. Truly, truly. Oregon is amazing. We got a really good start here. Really, really good start. Just have to make sure on the next floor we go down and pick up the dang uh, broken television. Whoop. Tap, tap, tap. We kind of want to go a little bit slow so we don't hit the DPS cap. Or, I mean, we already are gonna, as far as I'm aware. Tap, 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 tap. We missed one. Tap, tap, tap. Good deal. That's a dead darn gull. 50 piece there. Not bad. Oh my goodness. Not bad at all. We also even have a cell creep. We could sell some if we wanted. I will actually... I'm going to get rid of this because I think it sells for a decent amount. Yeah, it sells for a decent amount. We're definitely not going to use it. We're not going to use the Winchester either. 
I'm probably not going to use the icebreaker either, to be honest. I, I think I'd rather have all that money. Maybe we can turn in some money for the rat key. Maybe that's an okay thing to do to get some extra meta progression going, even though we're, you know, doing a, a whole lot of important meta progressing and unlocking three whole freaking characters, hopefully. All right, don't drop this immediately now. Or don't lose it immediately. Okay, we can we can drop it. We just need to make sure we always go back and pick it up. This is this is our baby for the day. The thing is, it doesn't have to be doesn't have to be a big deal. You don't have to really have you know have it hinder your gameplay as long as you just like drop it right away. Like here's the thing. This this is the annoying thing. Oh my god, we gotta bring it all the way. I wish it did like a little bit of damage. We gotta bring it all the way to the whole freaking forge. This is, it's a doozy. It's a doozy, but if we can do it, we're uh, we're great. Okay, second infuriating note. Let's see, is it up, up? Up, up, okay. That, the, the chance of it being the exact same pattern has greatly increased. Greatly. Yeah, just drop it. It's like it. It's like gun dropping, but even more uh, <laughs> rough to to remember. All right. Because gun dropping like this, you just you pick it up again immediately. All right, but yeah, like I have not had to do the uh, the robot. I don't think I've had to do this robot qu quest, if you can call it even that. Since literally my my first file, the other times that I have redone it or redone a, my file, which has it's happened once or twice, I I just didn't unlock the robot yet. Sure, we'll drop all that chimp chump change chimp change. Ballad is actually really really good. Also, we get a synergy. Hey, ballad gives you a like quite a bit of coolness. I think it's at least two coolness. So. uh the end of room drops should have gone up a decent ch decent chunk here. All right. We got all this here, the synergy being the one that makes it do the uh, the three planes right away. Boop. Hell yeah, 50 piece a map. This video game wants me to uh to succeed the map gives us a synergy as well oh my god somebody has to stop him somebody has to stop him you know what it would be a great day to go to the rat so that the rat couldn't steal our the rat couldn't steal our TV I, I think that we'll get another one or two over the course of the run and be okay. But man, that sucks. It's hard to hard to fight the reflexes sometimes, you know? Okay, still have the TV. I mean, if we don't need to dodge, we don't need to dodge. The more damage we do, the less reason there is for us to even bother dodging. So that's great. Oh my god, it's not even here. It might be... Honestly, it might even be over here. It is. Oh my god. Wow. Alright. Alright. Sinner Grace. Hell yeah. Been quite some time since I've seen anyone down here. Well, thanks very much for letting me out of this dreary place. Once I get a little bit of my strength back, I should be able to help you out quite a bit. I'm sure I'll be seeing you soon. We love a Sinner Grace. Holy moly. Also, we already have the map fully completed. Hegemony rifle, not bad, not bad. Not like amazing, but I'm happy to have it. I'm happy to have it. Okay, just rather not dodge if we can help it. We can't sometimes. All right, we got the TV, don't dodge. I kind of want to unbind, unbind my dodge roll. I wonder. I mean, the good news is we don't have to worry about dodging when we get to bullet hell, because we will have hopefully dropped it off at the uh, 
the <laughs> the forge. Otherwise, maybe we will have dropped it off at a at a pit somewhere. Is the other option. There may be. I wonder if there's even like a room of some kind where you actually like cannot successfully get it through. I wouldn't. It wouldn't be like completely unbelievable to me that there would be one that's accidentally like impossible with this challenge. We're out of blanks. Oh, horrible dodge. Wish we just had the TV, just had held the TV and didn't didn't use the uh, the darn dodge roll button. I feel like we would have been better off there, actually. Bait launch is great. Uh, so is the origami. So we're gonna fill that up. We do have the TV. We got a key. Cannot do the nod key though. I'll happily drop in all that money. So this is basically the price of a normal key now. Normal rat key, that is. Chest friendship. Ooh, I mean, I like it. I like it, it's really good. But we are gonna really wanna get some keys here. Chest vampirism honestly wouldn't be too bad right now. In fact, it would be really good. I wish wish we would maybe would have saved a little bit of money. Alright, well we still got the still got the TV. We did everything we need to do. We're not gonna mess with the elevator today or tomorrow. No problemo. Three, four, and five. That's all we got to get through. Throw it right there. The rat might actually be able to steal it there. So we need to be careful. Okay. Don't dodge. Hand off the mouse. Hand off the mouse. Alright. Good deal. Thank you. Glass guan stones unlocked. Took uh, all the way until like the last run. Wildly, I want to try. Oh, it's too far away. I'm almost positive it doesn't doesn't do anything. It'd be fun if it if it just did like dodge roll worth damage. Yeah, I'm worried about. I'm worried about the rat there. We could just do that. Okay, um, let's try to not do that room, if we can help it. If we find the boss, today may be one of the few days where I will actually consider skipping rooms. If there's a room that I that is an unnecessary challenge, I will, for, the, uh, for throwing the TV, I will say no. Okay. It looks like we might have to do it, though. The thing is, if you fall into a pit while you're holding the TV, I believe you drop it as well. Okay. There's an extra <laughs> chest. We're running running into a situation immediately where uh, we're definitely not going to have enough keys. If we could get an infinite key thing today, that would be so good. Okay, so we obviously have to try one of these. Let's t let's assess. Let's assess. That looks like it's going to take us to a chest. Let's test this out right here. Assuming this is this is that. So wait, where would we need to stand? Line up with that. Bounce right here. Would that be enough? This sucks. This sucks. Okay. Well, that was the hardest one, I think. All right. Good deal. Please tell me this is the correct direction. So, yeah, we don't have enough keys for the chest. So, we'll probably skip it. If that is the not a necessary direction. We'll probably skip it. Definitely keep our eyes out for the darn uh, darn bulletkin. 
We got our shop up here. That's that's neat. Buy yourself a buy yourself a key or something. I feel like we should just put on the uh, the jetpack or something. If we could get it, like if we could have that, the jetpack and two slots, that would be so good. Because then we wouldn't have to risk dodging at any point. Okay. So far, so fine, though. I mean, the, obviously, the biggest problem of the whole run is in the forge. That one room. That one room to ruin them all. Just too many pits. Don't want to chance anything. 58. Escape rope. I mean, if we had could have two items, that would actually be really... That would be, oh my god, that would be so good if we could have two items. We could just, as soon as we get to the forge, we could turn in the TV and not have to worry about that terrible room. Oh my god, that's, oh, uh, it's a bummer that we can't do that. All right, so I think we do this and then just, and then just ditch. Hopefully we get an extra active slot from this boss or uh, the one chest that we can open over there that would be pretty slick I think I might have missed with one bop 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 too fast in a row there okay out of them all right we're gonna be out of this too in a moment here the DPS is really really good here damage per second is amazing Give me an extra item slot or an accuracy down. That's fine. That's basically the same thing, right? We got an eye patch. I'm surprised that the eye patch and the Corsair don't have any any interaction. A little surprised. We got the TV, right? We do. Is there another key? We nope. All right. We're out of here. On to the next. On to the next. We got the tangle. We got the TV. All right. So far, so fine. So far, so fine. Just give it a for a second. God, I love the tangler. I like how good is it? It's like pretty good for as far as shotguns go. But uh, it's. Hilarious more than anything. I love, I love besquaring the people. That is my jam. I feel like there's not too many rooms on this floor that can show up that are. Can you take the TV? What if he could? Oh my god! What if I just, what if I just bungled it because he could take the TV? That'd be hilarious. I feel like this is actually the way to go. I feel, but yeah, I don't think there's too many that have a lot of pits. So I think that we're going to be largely okay here. Alright. Thank you. But like, in rooms that have pits and everything, honestly, taking a hit is going to be way better than, uh, oops, than dodge rolling. It's not gonna be a big deal like I'll happily like if I can just get there and have a lot of health I'll happily take a big chunk of hits because I'm not too worried about I fear not death effectively what I'm getting at God double synergies here let's go hell yes oops send him Where to the shop? What if we could? I wonder if we could sell the TV. I wonder if we could sell it on accident too. I really don't want to. But like, if we just dodge rolled over it, I wonder. Oh man, I would love the ability to steal, but we don't actually have the ability to get 
that right now. I'll take a key. I'll happily take a key. We have the ability to get it, but we don't have the ability to get it and have the TV. Mass shotgun is so good if you get the right distance with it. It's just, um, it's so ammo efficient for how much damage it can do. You get it, and only it, and you can probably just, like, use it for the whole freaking run. Like, and it's just, it's great for bosses. It's great for room clear. Like, I think it's maybe, maybe better for bosses than it is for, for room clear, but it's great at both. Um, we'll do some exploring. I'm, like I said, there's not really, this, this floor, there's not too many pits. I tried so hard to not even try to dodge, but like, why, why? Because we don't need to. We can dodge, it's okay. We just need to make sure we pick it up again. Okay. Got it, got it. Throw the TV at him. Wait, hold on. I mean, actually, that was working okay. Not what I wanted, but it was working okay. We don't have a key, so we're not even going to get a real reward by doing this. Okay. Yeah, okay. Little little creature. Little creature. It's one of those rooms that's kind of just like long. Way longer than it is challenging. Did not find the secret room? Correct. I and mean, it could be up there, I guess. I there's so many dang blanks. Seems like a wallmonger to me. It is indeed. I'm like really kind of worried. I'm going to throw the TV now. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Because I don't want the TV to get stuck in the boss. You know, that's, that's a big concern for me. Like, so we, there we go. It'll be up there. Good, 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 good. All right. I mean, I need to, I don't want to keep taking damage, but basically the big thing is I really just wanted to make sure, uh, I didn't permanently lose the TV. Because I feel like that can happen. We have so many blanks that I'm not using. But at this point, I, I had it in my head. Well, we took one damage, so it doesn't really matter. So I'd actually like to take these to the forge. So that in that one room, that one room that we keep talking about, we might actually not have to worry about it. All right, let's do a little bit of this for a second. You can sell that. You can sell that. You can sell that. Anything else we're selling? I mean, I can actually sell the flashlight at this point. It, it, did, a, it did a good job, though. Should probably sell Can we sell the infuriating note? No, we can't. All right. We got a hell of a lot of money now. To buy what? Ammo for the Deckard? I'll take a full ammo of the Deckard instead. No keys. Bust this open, I guess. And we are on to the forge. Just like that, we have the TV still. I'm happy with I'm happy with it. There's a chance that we can find the blacksmith without going through that one room. And also there's a chance that that one room doesn't even have the hammer nowadays okay Cause it, way back when oh man if that actually could get crushed if that could get crushed that would suck way back when when I unlocked it the first time that room always had the hammer there wasn't the possibility of it being that spider room which is definitely the preferred one for today Definitely for today. Hopefully we don't even have to go through it though. That it is a possibility that you can go around. Some runs it's trivial. Alright. Man, I can't believe I killed that one bullet, Kim. 
I have a feeling we're gonna kill kill it on accident again anyway. Disappointing. It's okay. We'll, we'll get him really soon. No matter what, I feel like we'll get him today or tomorrow. Still, anyways. Okay. 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 Table tech blanks is an interesting call for um, safely safely moving our TV. There's the boss. Interesting. Interesting. Don't want to fight the boss with, with the TV. Not that it really matters. HP down. Curse up. Damage up. Almost always worth it for the sake of... Oh, I got worried that that was the bulletkin. The bulletkin, you know? Okay. Okay. Don't dodge. I would rather blank than dodge there. We have so many. I saved them all up for this exact situation. This is literally why... This is why I have this many blanks. Why I let myself get hit on the, the Walmart to just like... It's okay. It's okay. It doesn't matter. It's all leading up to this. We only have four hearts though and I do hate that. I do hate that. Okay... Okay. That might help. Because I believe that does a blank effect even if we take physical damage. If we do indeed get the hammer room. Okay. Good deal. Oh, he's done it. He's done it. He's done it! Wah, wah. Wah, wah, wah. Guess he had somewhere to be! Alright, we got the gold amulet. That is so good. Blank damage way up. Now every time we get hit, we do a huge AoE blast of damage. And don't even take damage. Best thing of all though, we can dodge roll again. We don't have to think about the TV ever again. Ever again. Oops. Good deal. Now if we could get the... Uh, if you make sure we get the stinking bullet, that'd be great. I guess we could just leave, I suppose. But Here's the room. And here's the thing. We wouldn't have even gotten the... We wouldn't have even gotten the hammer one, which is so ideal. We would have, we would have been fine. Oh, you guys have it so easy. You guys have it all so easy nowadays. Back in my day, we had to roll uphill both ways to get the darn robot unlock. No keys. Table, tech, blanks would be really fun now. I want a lot of money or a lot of keys. Something, please. All right. Chunk. Whoopa! Whoopa! Amulet of the Pit Lord unlocked for some reason right now. <laughs> All right. We don't need the bullet to kill the pass, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The paradox cannot get that. Alright, up we go. I kind of like to not use my blanks and bring them down to the next floor, but yeah, we'll see what happens. I'll just try not to need them, you know? I needed that. Immediately. Normally, I do like to blank those just because they're annoying. But this is a really, really good gun for taking them out. Like to blank those too, but not today, baby. So we should space it out a little bit. Or let's check the HP. Yeah, we should probably space them out. 
Like to hide in the corner and then just watch the bullets coming from the right. Makes it way easier to dodge, in my opinion. All right. Looks like we're going to be able to go down with this many blanks. And we're going to get an HP up, which is going to be really, really nice to not just have four. After sacrificing the one there. Hoppa! Hoppa! Hey! Okay. Oh, so close! Invisible amount of HP. Don't get hit. I will cry. Okay. Yeah, literally one bullet away. You son of a gun. Son of a goblin. That line unlocked. I think that's just for beating the dragon a certain amount of times. Oh, we could buy a key. I will. Happily. Hey, that's a nice gun. That's a really nice gun. Get junking again. We've been getting him a really, like, surprisingly high amount. Okay. All right. Onward and downward. Here we go. It's a pretty fast run, I guess, because we skipped a bit of that floor. Also, we had, we just had a good run, I guess. It was just a nice, clean run with good synergies and everything. Okay. So do we have to fight the, I mean, we have to fight the Lich this first time? I know that normally when you play the Paradox, you don't actually have to come down here, but I guess today you do. All right. Just a normal, legitimate run. I'm not sure if you can find the bullet down here. I don't know. I, I'm not sure if I... I probably had this unlocked when I... At that point, right? I don't know. Did I unlock this or, or the bullet? The bullet first. I'm not sure. Don't recall, really. Oh, that... The damage up from that shrine is just so handy, though. Oh, so glad that I can dodge here. Oh, boy. Would have been great to have the um, the table tag blanks with gold amulet would have really wrecked, but oh well. Yeah, there's a lot of rooms that would be very annoying to mess with the darn TV for. Okay. Just pay, trying to pay so much attention to make sure I don't kill, because I it'd be it'd be fun to unlock. Because uh, we're not gonna after this after we kill the lich. If correction, if we kill the lich, we could die. I guess we could die. We don't have a ton of HP. We could die. Uh, we will not go back to the breach yet. So it'd be pretty slick if at least if on uh, at least the next run we got the bullet because then when we go back we'll have everybody just like that we'll have everybody and I'm so annoyed to think that we could have done it already but statistically they've been showing up at least one an episode right so therefore the next run should have one for sure too I would imagine I would imagine. I wonder if we maybe even killed more than one. I wouldn't be shocked. There's so many good guns. Like, so many good guns. The RNG from the last runs all got pushed over to this one. Jeez. Okay. Where you at, Pupilan? Use a little bit of that. Bait launcher, too. Oops. We do got the uh, lovely, currently lovely, 
Full Metal Jacket. Took me a moment to think of what it's called. So we won't take damage. We effectively have... Uh, look at all our blanks as shields. So, that's that, too. So we're, we're fine. We're fine. It guarantees you'll use all your blanks effectively. I'm disappointed. Truth be told, I think he would have died to the Full Metal Jacket amulet blank that inevitably would have shown up anyways. But that sucks. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm not sure. I, I feel like even if we see one at this point, I'd have to like quickly, quickly drop my Full Metal Jacket. That was a bad Full Metal Jacket blank there. We'd have to drop it really quickly, because otherwise we'd have to take out the room and make sure we don't get hit. But, yikes. That's the second one killed. You know what? It, it just makes me, like, all the more sure that we won't uh, have to worry about it. I do see that. It's just always the same secret room here, and it's never an important one. I wonder if they show up in rooms that normally would have a normal bullet kin, so we could, like use that to our knowledge. I feel like that's not the case, because I feel like that room normally doesn't have a bullet in there. Bonk. Alright. Disappointing. Two dead. It's just like... Uh... You need great reaction times to stop yourself from uh, your great, normally great reaction times. You know what I'm saying? It's like, how often am I? How often are you supposed to not shoot a thing in Gungeon? It's very rare, so it's hard for me to battle that feeling. But I'll try to do better. I feel like it could be one in here. Maybe there can only be one on floor or something. I don't know. Who knows the freaking rules? I feel like it's probably just... I probably... I, there's probably no rule except it's just... Percentage chance that it show, they show up. It seems like historically they've exclusively been in the first wave. Whoop. Whoop. So maybe we just pay extra attention when we and just exactly when we enter the gungeon room. That's probably the best way to handle it. Or a gunny, so good, man, so good, so good. Whoop! With all these synergies, it's even better. And with the damage up from the shrine, oh my god, so good. Don't want to kill any little cute bullet can. Wow. All right. We're uh, we're losing all our HP, <laughs> aka our blanks. But now we don't have to worry about the if we do run into a bullet can we don't have to worry about it dying to uh, to shields. We are starting to have to worry about actually dying on this run though. But this the thing is I'm not worried about the lich fight. We have so many great things for it. That I'm just not concerned. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Just pay attention. All right. So many keys. I mean, thank you. Frost Giant. It's a nice, nice enough gun. We're doing a full clear, man. What is up with that? Okay. Full clear. Okay, we don't really want him frozen. That just makes us have to wait longer. Get in the pit, get in the pit, get in the pit. Thank you. This could be it. This actually totally could be it. It's not, though. Obviously. Obviously. 
to be a rip room for the bullet kid, and it's not though. I'm trying to, so we could do that. It's attempting, attempting to freeze them both, and this is going to be the lich, right? Yeah. Okay. Currently, we're the bullet kid. We're the bullet, but we don't have the bullet unlocked. All right. Anyway, here we go. Unless we, unless we, we do, and they pitied us, so they just gave it to us. Such a good gun. Such a good gun. So much damage on the boss, and we don't even have to worry about the ads. What more do you freaking want? Oh my god. So good. There we go. Gotta do that so we can reload and place the amp right up in his face. That's the strat with this gun, really. Okay, moving on up. Bloop. Should be close enough. He's such a big boy. We can even hit him with three or four beams, I bet, if we placed it right. Okay. Not so bad. And up. Next. Phase three. Got this gun. It's so filthy good. Get up. Kind of close. This is dangerous, but we're good. Oh man, I thought I could put it on him. Wait, did we? Oh, he's getting hit by two. He's getting hit by two. No sir, Bob. Oh, you stinker. We were like, we were moments away from doing the Lich without getting hit once without any blanks. What on earth just happened? Ah, we will have to find out tomorrow because uh, we darn did it. We beat the uh i mean we didn't unlock the gunslinger yet but we are well on our way to let me tell you we're probably going to do it <laughs> it's the gunslinger is the fantastic character that we are going to be able to play as now obviously like by far the most overpowered of any character uh so i'm very excited for the next run we have un we did it we unlocked the bullet we put a huge chunk of change into the rat key we might even be able to go to the rat on the next run if, like, we'll, maybe we'll buy the key and then attempt to go down um, to the rat and try out my pattern from my other save file. Because I, so far, it's the same. The first two are the same, and they might all be the same. Who knows? But that is going to do it for today. Tune in tomorrow for the conclusion of uh, unlocking the gunslinger, but we got the robot out of the way. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more daily Enter the Gunship videos and more roguelikes every single day. Extra special thank you to Ounsu for supporting at the Go, Go Team Gungeon tier on Patreon. Super appreciate that. Uh, if you want to help support the channel, help support me doing this full time, patreon.com slash retromation. There's all kinds of tiers for all kinds of things. Thank you, everybody watching. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, everybody watching. I mean, I guess that's still a sentence that makes sense. Thank you, thank you. See you next time.